It's time for the Daily Sports Rush from Sports Not for August 8th, 2024. Hey, sports fans, Scott Branson here with your Daily Sports Rush from Sports Not. I've got a jam-packed show with the hottest stories from the sports world. So strap in and let's get to it. First up, the NFL is eyeing an 18th game for the regular season, just three years after adding the 17th. Commissioner Roger Goodell and the NFLPA are on board, but players like Seattle's Tyler Lockett are less than thrilled. Lockett would prefer another bye week instead of another game, but he knows that might not happen. Raiders' Devontae Adams isn't too excited either, saying it turns the season into a grueling marathon. But hey, more games mean more TV money. $113 billion over 11 years to be exact. And that extra game might just push the Super Bowl to President's Day weekend. More football? Sounds great for fans, but it's the players who'll be feeling the pain. Switching gears to college football, ex-Michigan coach Jim Harbaugh with the Chargers now has been slapped with a four-year show cause penalty by the NCAA for recruiting violations and unethical conduct. Now coaching the LA Chargers, Harbaugh would face a full season suspension if he ever returns to college coaching during this period. Harbaugh's infractions include texting during a dead period and misleading the NCAA, a big no-no. While Michigan managed to delay the fallout long enough to win a national championship in 2023, Harbaugh's past missteps have finally caught up with him. Injuries are a part of the game, and unfortunately, in college football, Texas running back C.J. Baxter is out for the 2024 season after a knee injury in training camp. Baxter, who had a promising freshman year, is set for surgery. Last season, he racked up 659 yards and five touchdowns, helping Texas win the Big 12 and make the college football playoff. With Texas moving to the SEC, they'll need to lean on their depth as they host Colorado State on August 31st to begin the season. Get well soon, CJ. The Longhorns will miss you. And finally, the San Diego Padres have surged into playoff contention with a dominant second half performance. Since July 19th, they have gone 12 and three, outscoring opponents by 42 runs. Stars like Manny Machado, Xander Bogarts, and rookie sensation Jackson Merrill have been crushing it at the plate, while pitchers Dylan Cease and Michael King have been lights out. The Padres have beaten some of the league's best and now hold the top NL wildcard spot. With one of the easiest schedules remaining, the Padres' playoff hopes are looking brighter than ever. All right, that is your Daily Sports Rush from Sports Not. Appreciate you guys being with her. For more stories like this, go check out sportsnot.com. Keep your game face on. It's Scott signing off. I'll see you tomorrow.